Hi, I'm Kartha Gewert, and this is Brandon Boyd. Yo, I'm doing an album. Brandon. You just released a new EP. Check it out on Spotify. Oh, that's gonna hurt. <laughs> Speaking of pain, today we are making an oddly satisfying milk dessert. The title is literally, do you have milk? Use the milk. And I've always wanted to make this creamy, flan like jiggly dessert, so that's what we're doing. <laughs> Starting off with enough butter to kill a small child. And we're gonna melt her down. In. Oh my goodness, <laughs> Get no. Down. Brandon! Brandon, where are your table manners? I've never known Brandon to like butter. I'm gonna heat up this pan soon so you have to keep your distance, okay? He deserves a treat for that, actually. Here. <laughs> Melting down the butter. Okay, this guy's gotta go. He's gotta go. This spoon is actually supposed... This spoon is actually supposed to be like a spoon. Don't put wood in the dishwasher, kids. <laughs> Why are you... He's licking the vapor in the air. <laughs> Stop. No. <laughs> Stop. I'll keep him at bay. You're driving me nuts and you're ruining my show, Brandon. <laughs> Good. Stay there. <laughs> okay, now we're gonna put some flour in the butter. Gorgeous. Hey, he's back as soon as the camera goes off of me. Comes right back. The vet said that Brandon is the most gorgeous dog. Ah. And that she wants one, but like, German Shepherds are a whole project and you're gonna wanna watch out. They have no fear of anything. Stop, you're gonna burn yourself. It's for your own good. He ran into a pole the other day <laughs> going down the stairs. Like, I can't stop him from being so clumsy. He had a bruise on his face. It looked like he got stung by a bee. And when I called the vet, they were like, we're gonna have to put your dog on payroll for like how clumsy he is. Okay, gorgeous. What's next? Oh, by the way, this is by one recipe a day, but it's in French, so what is that? Un jour, un recipe? <laughs> I don't know. They're stirring this with a whisk, so I should probably do the same. Cooking it up. Does that look right to you? It looks like mashed potatoes to me. Yeah, you know, it's supposed to be a little mushy. And then we're gonna add our milk, yeah, our liter of milk. This is the kind of stuff that I used to like pay money for, like panna cotta. Super fun. Hey, Brandon. Yo, I wanna be respected as an MC, yo. Well, how does that smell so good? It's literally just flour and butter. Okay, where's my milk? Do you have milk, they say? Yes. That's the question. Went and bought it just for this. No, this is leftover milk. Oh, right. Yeah, leftover milk. Leftover milk. Who in their right mind has leftover milk, though? Not me. Yeah, it's like spare change. <laughs> milk is the most delicious thing you can have in your house, especially if you have any sweets. Don't you get a little nervous by having this much milk? Yeah, if you get too much more than that, it's gonna start drinking you. Okay, question for you and actually the comments too. Do you think it's like crazy when people are like, who is the first person who thought of milking a cow? Like, do you think that question's trippy or do you think it's kind of whatever? I don't find that question trippy at all. Like if it was me, I'd see a calf weaning and I'd be like, I'll have some. But obviously I wouldn't apply it to other animals. Maybe goats. Cats. Not cats. Dogs. Not dogs. Never had some dog's milk? No. Whatever. If this conversation's boring, I'm done with it. And you're done with your milk. I'm making my milk curds. Is it supposed to be curdy? No, it's gonna it's gonna come apart. Okay. Don't worry. You starting over? Yes. I did it too quickly and too panicked because of Brandon. I gotta do it right. Okay, this is much better and not lumpy at all. Look. Much better. Much better. And now we're gonna add some sugar. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Come on, honey, honey. Wait, is that how it even goes? Yes. Nice. Now we're copyright clean because I did it so well. Oh, dang it. Now you're adding the ingredients super slow. Yeah, I'm crazy. scared. Carrie, I'm starting to pick up steam. Oh, so yeah. you have to make sure, okay? So you don't screw it up? Yeah. Well, I haven't seen the re whole recipe, so... Except if you try to take charge of my finances, I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you good. I'm gonna put you in a conservatorship. That's not funny. Hashtag free Britney. Okay, now we're gonna put our lovely cream. Well, we were supposed to cook it till it thickens a bit, but like... 
look, she's pretty thick. Um, I may or may not have put too much sugar. We like sweets around here. So maybe this is gonna be like restaurant style sweetness. I'm just like moving it into a bowl here and then I'm gonna let it set. Now I have to make the caramelly, creamy sugar topping. Mm -hmm. At this point, this is a challenge to see if, if you do everything backwards, if it still tastes good. I forgot to add vanilla extract to this while it was still in the pot. So gonna have to do that right now. Hooray! Yeah, it's still pretty malleable. Actually, this should work out. Yeah. I have to switch the bowl that it's in because this bowl is ugly now. Boom, roasted. It's time to make the sugar. Sugar dates, sugar dates and pistachios. I can sit like you too. Aw, oh, jeez. Now that Brandon's all settled in, I can put a little sugar in the pan. Now, I've never actually done this before, but you're supposed to just put sugar in a pan and apparently it like turns on a caramel. Are you sure you've never done this before, Kartha? I mean, I pretend that I've done it before, but I've never done this before. Like, what? You can melt sugar? It said put it on in low heat, but I feel like this is too low. I'm turning it up a little. <laughs> well, oh God. While we wait for the sugar to cook, I'm gonna take some cornstarch, tablespoon, put yep. it in here, and then give it a stir. Everything in this recipe is like centiliters. What even is that? The metric system. Never heard of that in my life. Yeah, you have. When? Elementary school. Never heard of that in elementary school. It's the metric system. Okay, fine. Isn't that so weird? Because I learned so much in like centimeters and all that stuff. But I get really confused when people are like, I'm 168 centimeters tall. I'm like, I don't know what that is. Oh, this is like actually melting down and turning into a little syrup. But like, am I supposed to just like put her in dry? Oh my gosh, it's actually, it's actually melting. Look at that, there's some juices here. Sugar juice. I thought I'd need to put in water to get sugar juice. Oh my gosh, it's happening. So many fun things with sugar happen on this channel. I know. Remember when we made our dog out of cotton candy? I do remember that. We've got a much bigger dog now. Maybe we should do it again. Oh my God, no. Actually, we better do it before he gets to be 100 pounds. Wow, you see the color? Nice brown. Nice brown. Look at the sugar, so good. Now I'm putting my cornstarch water in it. Oh geez. Um, Maybe should have done it a little at a time. Maybe. It's sticking to the bottom of the pan. Okay, I was scared there, but apparently this is what it's supposed to look like. And we're just cooking it until the caramel thickens. This much water was supposed to be in this recipe somewhere and I don't know where. Anyways, this caramel on top of this here flan. Ooh. I know it's gorgeous. It's gonna be sweet like candy. Okay, the spoon is so big and clunky. It's like hard to get it all to go. And it's funny because like I've had this at so many restaurants. I've paid a pretty penny for these and they are just easy. Now I'm gonna take this and put it in the fridge. Ah! All right, I've got this little spoon and I'm about, I'm about to cut in. I'm about to cut in. Get in up close and personal. Not to him. Oh, okay. Oh God, yeah. Make sure you don't screw it up. Oh, look at this. Look how beautiful. That's for sure. Oh my goodness. Ah. Very impolite. Oh. Oh. It could have been refrigerated for a little bit longer, but like, oh, it's like a butterscotch caramel milky pudding. Oh, yum! It's so good. <gasps> so good. So easy to make. All you need is a liter of milk. So much milk. Highly recommend that you try it. I'm gonna link the video that I use the recipe from in the description because I did a really bad job of telling you guys what to do. <laughs> like really bad, but it was worth it. And I hope you had fun. If you'd like to see me again, make sure you push notifications and I will see you on the next one. Bye.